today on oh, Darius Chews and Reviews. Dough already like kind of on the top. So I'm definitely gonna try to get a little piece of that on this uh, sample spoon piece. And uh, so let's go ahead and get into it. Welcome to Darius Chews and Reviews, another episode where we have some great treats and some great eats and some great reviews for you today. I'm glad that you were able to join me on another episode where I have my daughter here, a special guest. Her name is Reagan Garrett. Hi, guys. And I'm glad that you guys were able to join us today. So we had a show before where my first review, which was one of my best videos, was of me reviewing the Snoop Dogg cereal. Well, we have another influence by Mr. Snoop Dogg himself, which is the Dr. Bombay uh, ice cream that my daughter brought here. So go ahead, tell us a little more about it. Okay, so, for, so first we have the ice style orange cream. It's like an orange popsicle, and I'm really excited to try that one. Then we have the rolling in the dough ice cream. It's like a cookies ice cream, which I'm also excited to try because I really like cookies. Then we have the syrupy waffle sundae. It's like a waffle ice cream. Like it tastes like waffle. Ice cream. That's what I read. And yeah, I'm really excited to try that one too. Cool, cool. So we're gonna go ahead and get into it. But beforehand, I think I'm more interested in the waffle one, just due to the fact that I like waffles and I would think the ice cream that tastes like waffles would be really, really good. Which one are you most interested in? I'm most interested in trying the iced out orange cream because like, it tastes like a popsicle and I really like popsicles, especially ones that are like summer, like it's like summer kinda. And like, yeah, I'm excited for that one. Okay, no problem, no problem. So let's go ahead and get into it. We're gonna go ahead and start with the ladies first. She chose the orange cream, so we're gonna try the orange cream first. Let's get into it right now. Get some of the... Okay, all right, so we try it out here. What do you think? It's really good. I get. I think it's like very, very good. And I think I give it a lot of thumbs up. Okay, all right. Well, I definitely feel otherwise. I believe that um, when I tasted it, it tastes more like a cream sickle, of course. It's the orange sickle with the cream in the middle. And so it's good. It's just not nothing that I would personally want to, you know, just eat when I'm having a Netflix and chill night with the wife here or anything like that. But it is good. It's not bad. It's just something that I'm like, okay, well, if my wife wants it or my daughter in that sense uh, wants it, then we'll eat it together. But I give it a, not a thumbs up, not a thumbs down. I'm giving it a thumb sideways. I'm neither for it or against it. It just is. It's not bad, but it's also not the best that I've ever had. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and get into our second one, which is the Dr. Bombay Syrupy Waffle Sundays. Now this is the one I was most interested in. So let's go ahead and get into it and try it out, shall we? Yeah. Look like my spoon got stuck. Hmm. Okay. All right. So since I, since she went first last time, I'll go ahead and go first this time. So in tasting it, it is more or less like uh, exactly what it is. The syrupy waffle sundaes, that's what it tastes like. You can taste the syrupy taste. Um, I wish it would be more of a maple type taste. Um, it seemed like it's trying to go there, but as far as the taste of it, um, I would give it a mid thumbs up. I wouldn't say like it's, again, the best I've ever had, 
but it's also not the worst either and it's not bad. It's very sweet. And for me, of course, I'm a diabetic. And so um, it just seems like it's probably a bit too sweet and syrupy for me. Um, what? So what do you, oh, so in that, I give it like a medium between a side and a thumbs up. It would be kind of like a medium in between. What do you think? Okay, so I'm a kid, so like I really like sugar and I think it's good. It tastes like, it tastes like caramel, like one of those caramel Yasso bars. And they're, I think it's really good. So I give it like a thumbs up. Caramel Yasso? Like, you know the Yasso bars? No, I haven't heard of it. What is that? Okay, so it's like these health, it's uh, on the healthier side. It's like a, yeah, okay, it's a bar that's caramel and they have like multiple flavors, but it's an ice cream, just not as like sweet, I think. Okay, so we're gonna definitely have to try that on another episode, the Yasso bars, especially being that I'm on my health journey with my weight loss and everything. I think that would definitely be a great treat for your boy because I mean, you know, ice cream is good, but I would definitely love for it to be something a little more healthier for me. So let's go ahead and get into the last one and we'll go ahead and get into it right now. All right, so last on the list, we have rolling in the dough. What the? Rolling in the, what the, what the? rolling in the dough. What the, what the? Rolling in the dough. Anyways, I do apologize, I digress. But we do have the rolling in the dough ice cream by Dr. Bombay. Um, and so we're gonna go ahead and get into it. Um, you can actually, while looking at it, you can see the dough already like kind of on the top. So I'm definitely gonna try to get a little piece of that on this uh, sample spoon piece. And uh, so let's go ahead and get into it. Oh, you want some too? We have our special guest. Here, Roscoe. This is our special guest, Roscoe. He's gonna give his point of view. Want some of the back too? All right, so let's go ahead and get into it. It's very good and it also has like that sand kind of filling in your mouth when you have like taste like I don't know if you guys have tasted sand. Damn! But like it when you have it in your mouth, it's like like crunchy and yeah, I really like it. But yeah, I give it like Thumbs up, yeah. Okay, well definitely, I, I agree. I like it a lot. Um, I'm really, really thrown off by the fact that I was coming into this whole thing by vision and actually that makes you realize, makes me realize that you can't judge a book by its cover. Message. Reason why I say that is because I was looking at the waffle one, thinking that the waffle Sundays would be my favorite. But instead, the Dr. Bombay rolling in the dough actually had become my favorite. So I'm, I'm glad that I was able to try all three of these and because now I know that this is actually my favorite. Uh, the waffle sundaes, again, is okay. It's pretty good. It's not that bad, but it's definitely not my favorite. As well as the orange cream is good also but I do see this being more of a favorite, you know, for a demographic of uh, like youth and children that are, you know, between a certain adolescent age. So yeah, I definitely agree with my daughter that rolling in the dough was uh, probably the best out of the three, but all three of them are definitely great choices. I 
think the best one out of all, I'm going to have to go with rolling in the dough. It's, for me, it's the best because I really love the feeling. And it just tastes really, really good. But would come runner up in second place is gonna have to be hmm surprisingly the syrup waffle sundae because it tastes like so good and it tastes like caramel and i love caramel then in last place is the orange cream so yeah well uh, definitely so just make sure you guys i mean this is just our review and our takes on it so you don't have to take our word for it i definitely implore you all to go out and check it out for yourselves also notice that on the on the outside of it, it actually has a, a QR code that you all could scan. And when you scan the QR code, it tells you more about the ice cream. And also for the people that are on the weight loss journey, such as myself, just to let you guys know, um, the nutritional facts are definitely like um, kind of up there, like just for um, there's how many servings in here? Three servings, and per serving is about 220 calories. So yeah, it's 220 calories per serving, but the full pint is 660 calories. So I would say that it's probably not as bad um, for someone that you know is on a weight loss journey because, for the most part, a lot of uh, nutritional facts that you can consume up to 3,000 calories depending on who you are so I mean if you have a sweet tooth then this will probably be good and then the waffle sundaes actually has a little bit higher it's 300 calories per uh, serving and 890 calories per pint and lastly for rolling in the dough it's 330 calories per serving and drum roll please for a full pint is 1000 calories for this full pint of rolling in the dough so i would definitely employ um anyone that is on a weight loss journey to not eat a whole pint of rolling in the dough because that's just a whole lot thousand calories for one pint of ice cream so I'm glad that you guys were able to join me today. Again, my name is Darius. This is my lovely daughter, Reagan Garrett. I'm glad that you guys were able to join us today for our review. Make sure you tell us a lot about what you guys enjoy. There's other flavors out there and we would love to hear about it. So feel free to leave a comment as well as tell your friends about the reviews and have them come in and like and subscribe. We definitely appreciate it as it definitely affects the algorithm and lets YouTube know that you guys enjoy the content that myself and my lovely family is bringing to you guys. So again, my name is Darius for Reagan Garrett, and we want to thank you so much for checking us out on Darius Chews and Reviews. Bye. Peace.